Open door to my Megaton house. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Wadsworth, your personal robotic butler. I am here to look after your needs and to keep you happy and entertained. What can I do for you? I'd like a haircut, please. Certainly, I am programmed with a multitude of hair shaping scenarios. What? If you would care to choose one, I would be happy to replicate it for you. That's cool. Tell me a joke. Two atoms are in a bar. One says, I think I lost an electron. The other says, are you sure? To which the other replies, I'm positive. <laughs> yeah. I'm positive. Oh my god. My humor emitter array requires recharging. Aww. Certainly, madam. Here you are. Ooh. If there's anything you require further, feel free to ask, madam. Nice. I love it. I love it. Well, that works out. Now I get a bed to rest in. Whoa, can we store stuff? Activate bobblehead collector stand. These, these still stay a part of my character, though, right? Look at all the stuff I can sell. Wow, there's food! Madame Loco. <laughs> my character lives here, too. What a coincidence. Wow, how can I even afford a robot? It's best soft amiibos. Where's my bed? I have to buy a bed? Uh, Wadsworth, is this your room or my room? This looks like your room, actually. Where's my- I don't have a bed? I'm gonna store all that junk that I think I might need, but I I just don't know what to do with it right now. Um, like there's a ton of stuff I'm just like holding on to. Railway spikes, what? Hey Hank, what's up? How's it going? Nice, Jackie, nice. Upstairs? I don't... Oh, wait, how did I miss that room? Wait, how many times did I walk by that corner? What? Oh my gosh, guys. There's no sleep until healed function. What time is it? 1.54? Let's see how, uh... Oh, three hours of... Oh, nice. Alright. No, Gregor, no. Oh, my house is awesome. Okay. Um, I think we're good now. We have ammo, we're, we're rested. We've got a house. We can, like, literally sell all the stuff. 
if we need to. You've got guns? Uh, let's sell that one piece of scrap metal. I don't know if Walter's in his place. We'll go check to see if Walter's in his place. Oh, I've never been in Lucas's house. Why is everybody pleasing right now? His house looks like mine. Staying out of trouble, I hope. Don't want to have to waste good bullets on your sorry hide. You st Okay, his house is like the same as mine. You can buy more stuff for your house? Yeah. That's okay though. Oh my god, I can't wait for the crafting and building in Fallout 4. Oh my gosh! Oh, oh, that's... Alright, we're gonna have to fall. Oh! I almost died. We gotta go back to the house and sleep. Oh my god, guys, a please word, really? Bye, Zephyr, take care. Oh my gosh, guys. What time is it? There we go. You are no longer well rested? Why the hell am I no longer well rested from sleepy? That doesn't make any sense. You're now well rested, what? <laughs> what? Alright, save? Um, and then... Check our map. Okay, so I think what I want to do first, let's see if we can go to the super duper mart and find that guy's, um, find that boy's dad. Go find the dad. Who's, who else is excited to do the loop of Loco jumping off her deck to walk back up and heal? <laughs> What's up, Alex? <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, we found some ammo from that guy. That's somebody's head. Where is this annoying ass kid? Let's check our quest log. I don't know where this guy's dad is. At Grey Ditch to the south. Alrighty. This is John Henry Eden, your president. There are some things we should talk about. What's up, Solitude? You know What's up, Hi, I'm Rogo. How's it going? Damn, this place is massive.
up, Caleb? All right, we leveled. What do we need? Okay. Um. We were three short on medicine to this, to investigate the dead body, so I really want to do that. So let's go three medicine. Um. Lock picking, we want to get to 50. So that uh, we can. Um, we unlock like a, the next level of lock picking. Um, so we're gonna go 10 lock picking. And then I do want to keep up with my repair so that I can keep repairing things. Um, hey ho, terrific! Oh, Hermes, yeah, are you wondering what mods to get? Yeah, yeah, if you use the mods I got, it's so vanilla. You don't change anything about the game itself, but it's just stability. And it's worked, knock on wood, very well. Uh, we actually haven't had a single crash yet. So, going well. Hey, some guy! How you doing, some guy? Um... Let's see... Man, there's so many skills that I need. What's up, Not Not Jack? How's it going? Um, there's so many skills that I need, I'm sorry, okay. Um, so let's go with... I still need to improve my small guns, or else I'm gonna really fall behind. Let's go to repair. We'll go... Two small guns and two speech. There's so many skills that I need. I like that problem though. I like having all these things that we need to work on. It like encourages me to like really want to level. Um, that's what we're gonna go with. Wow, we have a lot more skill availabilities. Um, Let's see... With the- oh, the bloody mess! Hey! Nice! Oh my gosh! And 5% extra damage? That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Hey, some guy, please. What's up, Oreg? How are you? Yeah, Woody, I agree. I mean, this game is totally fine, Vanilla. I don't know why people freak out like they need mods for everything. I think for your first time, um, I think Vanilla's the way to go. It's really not that bad at all. <laughs> uh, okay, so Bloody Mess we might do. Fortune Finder. Nah. Gunslinger. Nah. Lead belly. Nah. Nah. Okay, so. Five percent extra damage. Um. I mean, that's only like one, maybe one damage for the assault rifle, like one to two damage extra. For right now. I mean, 5% is not that much. But, uh, I mean, out of everything here, I'm either gonna go with Bloody Mess, or something that, like, like Thief, or I would do another Gun Nut. Which I might do another Gun Nut. Or Science and Medicine. You guys think bloody mess? Okay, we we've done bloody mess every every game, so maybe I think we have to. I think we we have to. Can't wait until Fall Four. I know, I know. All right, we're gonna go with bloody mess because we've done it every playthrough, and I love it. <laughs> All right, let's save. 
Wow, my HP is super low from that. Can I make sure I have my right uh, armor on? Okay, good. Let's uh, throw on some stim packs. Let's use my assault rifle. What's up, Zoe? Or I guess Zoe, what's up? Let's hope there's not too many of those around. Always, why is it always dark out for me? Oh, nice. Oh no, what is that? Nice. Some kind of crazy person? Dude, I'm not a crazy person. It was an ant. Activate Pulowski Preservation Shelter? Oh no. Time zone am I in? Uh, Eastern Standard Time. Or I guess it's Eastern Daylight Time, I don't know. Eastern! Um... The local upper intelligence get 19 points. Uh, we did a perk for that. What's up, Murphy? Um, we started at noon Eastern, so it's been two hours. What's up, no Scopey? Alright, let's save again. And we continue. All right, so let's activate. Anyone out there? Hello? Dude, what are you doing, kid? Brian, what are you doing here? Do that again. Come on, tell me already. It used to be kind of nice. No one bothered us there. I guess because we were so close to DC. There were seven of us living there in tall, old brick houses. I think I'm the last one left. Those things. Like yes. everyone else. Nah. People don't like to stay long in Great Itch. The DC ruins aren't a great place to make a home, you know. In fact, Papa was talking about moving on soon. We've been here for maybe a year. Best loved in Great Itch. Um, besides me and my Papa, there was... Doc Lesko, who stayed with us, and Will Brandis, and his mama and papa, too. I guess they're all gone now. <laughs> Ron Top. Hey, Jasmine, what's up? I left that kid in there for three weeks? Hermes, that's so freaking messed up. Alright, what is it? Mind if I ask about some of the people who lived here? Nah, go ahead. It's just nice to talk to anyone about stuff. Isn't this the same kid at the store? This kid was like a freaking nutcase at the store. He was a strange man. He paid Papa some caps to help him build a shack he was like and carry annoyed. a bunch of junk into it. Papa called him an egghead, but his head was shaped regular, so I didn't get it. He spent all of his time in that shack next door to my house. 
Every time I'd sneak in there, he'd be sitting at that funny-looking TV machine with the green words pushing buttons. Any idea what Dr. Lesko was doing in Great Itch? Nah, he was a nice man, but he never wanted to play with me very much. Sorry, we sorry, I guess. All I know is he was all gone when the ants started showing up. I think they got him too. I don't know. All kinds of doohickeys. Doohickeys. Boxes with lots of lights, some funny glass bottles. Oh wait, he had a big, <laughs> clunky, shiny man too. That was kind of neat. About the other people. Yeah. The Brandis family. Well, there is Will. He was sort of my friend, and then there was his dad and his mom. Where did they live? Right across the street, actually. It was pretty swell having someone to hang out with so close by. So you and Will were good friends. Yeah. Will was super nice to me. He was like a year older than me, I think. He even shared his comic books with me. We that's explored nice. pretty much every bit of Great Itch we could find. I think that's why the ants don't bother me. I have good hiding <laughs> spots. <laughs> Tofu. How about Will's parents? Well, his mom was nice too. She was kind of quiet. But she always took care of me and my papa when we came over. I think she was sad that my mom was gone. Oh. Will's dad was... Well, I don't want to be mean, but he was kind of scary. Will's dad was scary, how so? He was like, always watching me and my dad real careful, like he didn't trust us or something. He always kept staring at us from the windows of his house and typing stuff into his TV box. Will said his dad was like an old soldier or something, but he didn't like doing that stuff, so he quit. Alright. How do I get- how do I stop talking to you? Yeah. Alright. What is it? Can you tell me more about the things attacking Grey Ditch? Well, they're big- Ugly things hey, that crawl around on six legs. They got huge teeth and skitter around grabbing everything in their path. My papa would always say they're fucking ants. Hey! Well, that's what he used Watch to Watch your me. mouth! I just call them fire ants. I'll slap ya. My papa had a gun. He said it hurt those things. But he said they were the dumbest fucking ants he ever saw. Alright, you say that word one more time, kid, and I'm putting antenna. you back in this box. Whatever that means. Nah, those things started coming around only in the last few months. I didn't even listen to what he First, said, because I was busy yelling at him. around outside our town. But later, they came into town, and, well, you know the rest. I don't, uh, wait. My papa had a gun. He, he kept telling everyone to oh, shoot. Oh, shoot for the antenna, okay. I didn't even listen right. to what he said, because I was so it? caught up in, like, telling him to watch his mouth. Look for the house nearest to the billboard that's sticking out of the ground. It's pretty close to the diner. You can't miss it. I just wish things would go back. He said the shoot for the antenna. Thank you, AGR. <laughs> What's up, flying agent? How are you? I don't know why he's there. No, I know what a TV dinner feels like. I don't. I don't know why you said that. Is it bad that, like, I have this weird, like, desire to be in this world? Like, even though, like, I really, like, it would suck. Oh! Oh, there it is. But, like, I don't know. I just, like, I love it. I don't know. It's a weird feeling. I don't know how to describe it. All right. You're gonna still shoot for their face because that's- Oh my god, Gregor. Gregor. You're the worst. Any of these cars work? Hey, Agent Hugbert, what's up? How you doing? Okay, this place is massive. 
Like, this place is freaking massive. <laughs> Charles. This means you want an adventure? Like, I wish that I was, like, scavenging and just being here. <laughs> it's so weird. It's so weird. Boom, baby! That one shot, though. Wrecked. Alright, whose house is where and what? How what? This place is massive and lost. Boom, baby! Coming at me, bro. Ah, uh, you made me use more than two bullets. Nice, Agent. Oh! Agent Hugbird, damn it! Yeah, Devil Driver. Hey, Costos. Really, Zombatron? Damn, nice. Hey, this is Nampo. How have you been? Good to see ya. He still thinks she's in the ARC tournament. Uh. Is Josh here? What's up, Josh? Yeah, I'm sorry I missed your message. What's up, Josh? How's it going? I hear you. I hear you. Uh, I don't like you. Back off, bub. Alright, can we- let's see our vast percentage. Oh god, they're coming. Back it up, back it up! What is my degree in animal science? Rip ears? Why rip ears? I didn't yell that loud! Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh, I'm almost out of ammo for this gun. That's sad. I really like this gun. Oh my god. Get back it up, back it up. Back it up. I I'm against the wall. Run away! Hey, thanks, Arag. I'm so inaccurate with this gun. There we go. What if they had flying spiders? I would just quit this game. I know, right, Loco? You never yell. I never yell. I just talk loudly sometimes. With emotion. Animal science, you said? What made you choose gaming instead of something in your field? Um, I didn't plan to be a streamer. I, I just kind of fell into it. Um, like, I, 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 I didn't really... It out. It just kind of happened, and I loved it. Ah! I mean, I've always played video games, but um, I didn't think that I would like do it for my job. <laughs> you know? Not like I planned it out. Uh, yeah, Adria. I mean, I don't. I mean, I get why people don't like. The teaming. I mean, it is kind of like crappy to uh, like from a viewer perspective, um, but I get why they did it, and there was nothing against the rules about it. So, um, and the people that teamed are very rich now from that. How's your day? It's good, Josh. Um, I went to the store. <laughs> I don't do anything in the mornings. I just like sometimes do errands, but I went to the store. Oh, oh, I got... Uh